I had this tag that I picked up at Hobby Lobby. They were $19.99 and they were 70% off. I don't know if you guys remember. What I'm about to do, you can pretty much find any board. I'm just going to happen to use the back side of this. And we'll start with my Republic Red. And I did a sketch prior to starting to paint. And this is his little hat. I'm going to make a gnome. I will have a PDF available for anybody who's interested. Um, probably midday today, I'll have that ready. So I just filled in his hat with Republic Red and his shoes with the black. They are pretty easy to make. And what's fun about them, and, and make it fun, is that um, they don't have to be perfect. They all have their own little character about them. So I filled in his shoes at the bottom with the black. And then I'm going to take the snow owl for his beard. And then create these little wispies at the bottom of his beard. I found these stars at Target. I'm going to take two. They came in a pack of, I believe, six. And I'm going to start by painting one with Bowie. And the other snow owl. I'm going to take a little stencil. I picked the stencil. It's from Folk Art up at Michael's. It's like a distressed star. And with the snow owl, I'm going to put it on the one Bowie star. And then the second star, I'm going to make stripes. I took some of my painter's tape and cut it in half. And you start by stacking your strips of, of tape and then removing every other one. You're basically using the one as a guide for the spacer. Then I'm going to paint in between with the Republic Red. So now I have a red and white striped star and a blue with star stencils. I'm gonna create his nose. I'm gonna start with Republic Red and then just mix in white until I get a, a pink tone nose. Once all that dries, I'm going to take my painter's tape and go across his hat. Again, um, I'm using a fatter one for the stripe and then a smaller one for my spacer. And then removing in between. And leaving the fatter, I believe it's a one inch. Then I took the tape and placed it around the edge of his hat, just so that I don't go over that area as well. And then I'm gonna fill those stripes in with white. Then I'm going to remove my tape. And now at this point, you could either take a star. I would probably take the blue one and have him holding that. But I decided to be a little creative here. Um, my placing wasn't perfect, but I took a, I had like a, uh, 
a red and white yarn that I put around his nose and I made the stars as his glasses, his sunglasses. I had this left over from last year. It was a little truck with some signs. You can get things like this right at the Dollar Tree and I dismantled them. Um, I took the Liberty part off and uh, used my wood glue and some hot glue and just glued it on an angle kind of in the center of his beard. And now I'm taking some iron oxide by Wise Owl and I'm just gonna paint what would appear to be hands on either side like he's holding the sign. And now you have this cute little Americana gnome that you can hang on your door or on your wall. I really hope you enjoyed this video. For other tutorials, go check us out on YouTube. You can now watch all our videos at chocolateafancy.com for any paint products, tissue paper transfers. Now our mesh stencils, chocolateafancy.com.